Okay, basically what I've done is I've ripped picket, a, a single picket into two pieces pretty much. Um, I ripped up a bunch of these pickets. I put them together and battened them on the back here. Stapled them to hold the pickets in place while I put my painting on here. This is the Arnold painting. And the Predators over here. Uh, also numbered them in the back because once I take these things apart after I paint them, can you see the numbers? Where am I? Once I take these apart, I'll have a hard time figuring out where they go, so I got them numbered. Um, that's basically this part of it. Uh, now I got to rip, rip these angles on the table saw so that they'll fit together the right way, and that's sort of the trick to it all. And I'll show you that in a second here. Oh my god, it's hot. Okay, here's the Predator painting. All the pieces are stacked on, on its side. What I gotta do is, or what I wanna do is, I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna cut the little dog ears off the ends. And cut them all the same length. So we'll do that first, and then I gotta cut an edge, a 45 degree angle, on both sides of the picket. I'll show you why in a bit here. Okay, you probably saw how big these paintings are when they were next to each other, but when I stack them on their sides, right here, that's both paintings right there put together. I think this thing's gonna be close to eight feet tall, and or six feet tall, eight feet wide. So by the time I'm done with it, maybe seven and a half feet wide, we'll see. Is it 150 degrees outside today or what? Behind me is uh, both paintings, believe it or not, uh, stacked sideways. I cut them all at 71 inches, but now I had to actually take off because my daughter got her learner's permit yesterday. So Joey, I'm gonna go teach her how to drive. I'm gonna take the end of this when I get back. I have to cut a 45 degree angle. I have to figure out which side is the front, cut a 45 degree angle on it, and which side is the back, uh, cut an inside 45 degree angle on the back. Anyways, I get one shot at this, because if I cut it wrong, <laughs> I'm screwed. So, anyways, I'm gonna do that when I get back, and hopefully there'll be enough daylight I can put this thing together. Hey, I wonder what happened here. <laughs> How come those guys don't get sick of picking that crap up every day? Okay, basically, you can see what angles I'm cutting on this thing. This part here is going to be the Predator. This part here is going to be Arnold. So when you look at the whole entire painting from one side, you see Arnold. When you walk around, you'll only see it from one direction. Uh, this way and uh, it'll be Predator if this is making any sense to you. I'm actually confused. I started to, uh, obviously I have to rip a 45 degree angle on the tip. I was thinking I had to rip a 45 back here, but after ripping the first one, I realized it actually eats into the painting that far. So I can't rip the back side. I gotta figure out another way. Like I said, I've only done two. Can't remember how I did it. I'll make it up as I go along. Anyways, this is the first piece. These are in sections. I'm gonna have to nail those together. This still has to be nailed together with those. If this is confusing for you, join the club. Either way, I'm gonna figure it out and we're gonna work it out and it's gonna work. I did a bunch of stuff today that ate up all my time. And I'm going to try to get this done before the sun goes down, if that's possible. Anything's possible. 